Google Sheets, insert a chart. Now that we have our numerical data in here, and I can, I can see that, I can understand it, but I want to get a visual representation of this information. What I'll do is I'll insert a chart that will create a visual, depending on what I'm interested in. So over here is an icon that says insert a chart, as well as up here, insert chart. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take these things that I want to look at, student name, assignment one, two, total points, average, and then I'm going to highlight all of that for each of the students. I click on my insert chart, and here comes a chart for me. And I can click through and I can determine which charts. These are the ones that are recommended for us. So I'm looking at this graph and I'm thinking, wow, okay, I've got the assignment one, assignment two, and then the average score that are being represented in here. And you can see as I click over them or hover over them, it gives me the totals. Okay, but it's kind of weird also as you go up and you think, well, out of 300, and, and that doesn't really explain it for me very well. But I do like when I hover over, I can see that information. So then I can get in and I can customize and, and move from there. So that's one way of doing this. I'm just going to insert this to show you guys what happens when you insert the chart. It pops it onto the spreadsheet and then I can move it over. Okay, so that's one way of doing this. I'm gonna click out of that. Down here on the bottom, there's the Explore feature. And just like in a Google Doc or Google Sheets, I mean Google Slides, that Explore feature gives us some recommendations as well. So I'm gonna click on that. And I'm gonna scroll down and I start seeing, oh well, there's some there's some you know charts down here as well. So I can take one of these. I kind of like this one right here and I can just click on it and move it into my spreadsheet and this gives me kind of what I'm looking for here it gives me assignment one assignment two, the total points and the average so that sets it up for me and now the next thing is what if I want to take this chart and I want to move it into a Google slides or a Google Doc I'm going to show you how to do that in a Google Doc well I can just copy this by doing a command C or control C, I copy it and I can bring it over to my doc and paste it in. Link the spreadsheet or paste unlinked. I'm going to paste unlinked and there it is. It pops right into my Google Doc. I can also in a Google Doc, I can find a chart if I wanted to. So I can go up here to where it says insert chart and then I can start searching through my different spreadsheets here and insert in a chart from a spreadsheet you know that I've collected somewhere else. So I'm going to go back here to the grade book and just kind of go back over this. So insert chart and then you can manipulate it. You can use the fun the, the explore you know option down here and then you can always copy and paste over to a Google Doc. That has been Google Sheets how to insert a chart.